Hello friends, I have a Dollar Tree haul and a Hobby Lobby haul. So we're just gonna get right into it and we're gonna start off with our Dollar Tree haul. So I finally ran in to what I call the Tiffany Teal Soap and Suds one. I did haul the white one. If you have not checked out that um, Dollar Tree haul, you'll definitely wanna check that one out. Anyways, I did find the Soap and Suds and Tiffany Teal, so I did pick it up and I do put, what I use this for is I put my bath and body soap on it and that way there's not like all that water that accumulates around it. So anyways, I picked up this one. Um, on our Instagram, they had all the colors. So please check out our Instagram. And I also picked, up, picked it up in the pump because I really like the white one. I put my um, dish soap in there and I use this um, to pump it out. So when I do my dishes, I have something cute to look at. So this will be, um, I'll probably bust this out uh, in spring if the white one doesn't break. As a matter of fact, I might go back and just stock up. That way I don't have to worry about these pumps breaking. And then, um, yeah, it's just always good to have more on hand. I really should have picked up more while I was there, but I didn't. But I was super happy to find a set. They had the gray, they had the Tiffany teal, and they had the white which I hauled last week. Again, please check our Instagram. All right, so I forgot to haul my loofah for our trip to New York, so I picked peaches and cream. And um, yeah, I'm getting, as New York keeps getting closer, I'm getting more excited. So that's gonna go with me. And um, I also needed to pick up some more face makeup wipes because I start, I have to have like, I should have bought more of these as well. Um, all right. Coconut water. Um, this is by Bolero. I absolutely, this is my favorite. This would definitely be my favorite one, but I also grabbed another one in pink sea salt and rose water. And then I grabbed one in the coconut. I've had all three. I do like all three. I usually like to keep at least five on hand, but, um, today I just grabbed three of them. So definitely glad. And what's funny is Bolero used to be ridiculously hard to find out here in California and now we have Bolero at every single Dollar Tree so that is really nice and honestly this is where I do get um my makeup wipes all right don't worry we're gonna start getting into the fall stuff right now I think oh wait oh wait okay I did get this this is RVO tropical coconut lip balm vitamin E and aloe smooth and moisturizes. I'm a sucker for anything that says tropical coconut. So I just grabbed it. Um, I should have named myself the lip gloss queen because I absolutely love lip gloss, lip balms, anything like that. So, all right, that is what I picked up that was not um, Halloween or harvest. Let's see. All right, I, of course I am doing my Halloween tree and I've never been early enough at Dollar Tree to be able to get their lights. So this was nice. And I decided that I was gonna grab two of the 10 um, jack-o'-lantern lights. And the reason why I chose these is because I can keep up a harvest tree. Because the jack-o'-lanterns are definitely, you know, for harvest as well. And they don't look that spooky but they can also definitely, of course, pass for Halloween. So yeah, so I'll have 20. I just have one of the little white trees from the Dollar Tree. Actually, I have two. I have the green and the white one from Dollar Tree, and I do decorate them. So I'm gonna be doing my Halloween tree and keeping in with the Halloween theme. I did pick up these Halloween bulbs, and each one does have five. So I did get, of course, the glittery orange, and you have the bat, and that is what comes in that. I just picked out, obviously, like the generic um, Halloween colors. And then you just have the black sparkly bulb. And then it also has the spider web. And so I'm going to be decorating my two trees with a mixture of these bulbs and the lights. Which now I'm really worried <laughs> I don't have enough lights. Oh, well, let's keep going. Okay, so 
I finally was able to complete my set and now I do have a complete set um, in three different, this is my third Dollar Tree haul and the first one I hauled the white one, I'm sorry, the first one I hauled the orange one, the second one I hauled the white one and now I found the black one and I do have all three so we have thankful, grateful and blessed in the black and I was super glad that I finally found it. All right, staying with signs. We've been seeing these everywhere, and now I know where they're inspired from, Hobby Lobby. So, of course, we have Thankful, and you have the gingham, black and white, bl um, black and white gingham. Also, the black and white gingham is at Dollar Tree. They have the, um, gosh, um, I want to say the towels for the kitchen, hand towels for the kitchen, and they also have the oven gloves. And um, they also, the kitchen towels say blessed. And if you're, if you're not a friend on our Instagram, I highly suggest you follow us on Instagram because I did take pictures. Anyways, that, I just thought of that because of this black and white gingham. So I really do like this, this thankful sign. And I also, of course, grabbed thankful and gather. And I love how they did the pumpkins in green and so forth. So I know you guys have been seeing a lot of people, a lot of people haul these, but they finally hit my local uh, Dollar Trees. So I was able to get my hands on them. And something that I hadn't seen and I found yesterday is this. And it's a mason jar and it says, hello, fall. It does have the barn and of course the iconic red truck. And we have all kinds of um, autumn leaves and trees and we have the pumpkins. So that is really cute, and I was definitely surprised when I saw it. So grabbed one of these, and let's see what else I was able to find at Dollar Tree. Of course, I had to get this one. Now, they do have it in blue, and I'll show it to you right now. And you have the cute pumpkins. You have the... Oops. I don't know what type of ribbon this is, but you do have the faux galvanized leaf and it says happy harvest and then you have the twine to hang it up with and just super cute. And here is the blue one. See, I didn't know which one I liked better, so I just had to get both. <laughs> I didn't have to, but you know, I mean, they are basically the same except one is blue and one is red and I just liked them both. So I'll just put them in two different places and I don't think anyone will notice that they are dupes. Okay. I love, I fell in love with these and these are the best sunflowers I've seen. So I just decided to grab these bundle for a dollar and I have a lot, a lot of floral stuff from Dollar Tree and I am super excited to get started on making some floral arrangements but these are just gorgeous and you get I think it's one two four five in a bundle for a dollar so that is awesome all right we're gonna get into Hobby Lobby now I know this was not a big mm -hmm. Dollar Tree haul but as the stuff is coming out I am bringing it you know I am shooting it and this is what I was able to find. And there is still a couple of items out there. Now, again, um, this is my third fall Dollar Tree haul. So I have hauled a lot of the stuff. But there's a couple of things that I'm looking for. All right, let's get into Hobby Lobby. All right, I did get this Farm Fresh um, vase or milk jug for $0.87. Cents. It was 90% off and this was $7.99 and yes, it is chipped, but they said if they would have given me 10% off, I would have gotten the whole thing for free, which of course I was kind of like, well, we can do that, you know, <laughs> but, uh, Hobby Lobby, you know, I mean, I got it for 87 cents and honestly, by the time I'm done doing my autumn arrangements, you're not going to even be able to see that. Now, the cash register told me that people are using Top Ramen to fix these kind of chips. So, I don't know. I'll have to look into that as well. But I thought for $0.87, cents, and this was on the clearance, it 
I don't know why it was on clearance. It's super cute. And now it's here at my house. And it will be holding some autumn flowers. Next from Hobby Lobby. Yes, I had to have this. Um, I fell in love with it. And like I said in the video, this red truck I can keep on my table for Christmas. And, you know, just switch out the pumpkin with another Christmas um, little pepper shaker. So I fell in love with this and this was, this is from Hobby Lobby and this was $5.99 and of course everything is 40% off. So yeah, this is going to go on my table. Super cute. And this is a really simple picture. It just says give thanks. Now I'm not really sure as to why it was discounted so heavily because I'll show you it was $23.99 and instead they had it priced for $5.99. So I picked it up and I was just a little, you know, I want to make sure it was really $5.99 because it says give thanks and this is harvest decor and it is awesome. I mean, there is nothing wrong with it. Um, I don't know why it was on discount, but I am glad it is because now it's mine. And I did pick up this moose picture because it reminds me of harvest and Christmas. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to do something and maybe, I mean, I know a lot of you guys are really creative and you guys do DIYs and you guys can tell me how I can make this look, um, a little bit more Christmassy when that season does come or a little bit more for harvest and Thanksgiving, but I just really liked it because it just looks rustic. And for some reason, when I think of rustic, and this reminds me of being in a cabin, I think of fall and Christmas. So yes. And again, this was on clearance. So, and what I love is you'll actually see how it's real wood. <laughs> So that's pretty cool. All right, this was $29.99 originally. Um, oh gosh, you know what? I wish I knew how much I paid for it. But it was 90% off. So, yeah. Oops, please don't break. Okay, this was, let me see. All right, all of their spring shop was 90% off. So 90% off of $29.99 is how much I paid. And you'll see right there, uh, Hobby Lobby. Yeah. So again, great deals. And I fell in love with this plate. <laughs> I said it while I was filming. I said, I love this plate. And it says, give thanks with a grateful heart. And it has these beautiful leaves and acorns. And I just love it. It is really a nice fall slash harvest plate. And um, I will definitely be using this on my table. But until it's time for Thanksgiving, it's going to go. Either I'm going to find a stand for it to stand it up. Cause this is heavy. I'll tell you this right now. This is a heavy, heavy plate and it is a big one. It is a big plate. So this was $15.99 and oh, it's microwave safe and dishwasher safe. That's good. Okay. So it was 40% off. So that was another good deal. And like I said, um, you know, this is, to, this is going to be a nice decorative serving plate for Thanksgiving. And this plate, this was another one that I just, I was not walking out of Hobby Lobby without buying this plate. I love it. I love the detail. I think this one I might put on a stand because that looks really nice. I just, I, I really don't know what I'm going to do yet. I just am getting stuff together and I fell in love. Um, this is, let's see, $13.99, so 40% off of $13.99. So I did pick up two plates. I picked up my salt shaker, uh, the red truck, and the pumpkin. And I did pick up two, um, pictures, whatever you would like to call them. And let's see where my other picture is. Let me show it to you again real quick. That could be why it was... Markdown. It does have a little nick. 
and I did pick up two pictures. Now, how much did I pay for everything? $33 at Hobby Lobby with two plates, my salt and pepper shaker, and, oh, my, my vase for 87 cents, and my two pictures. So, it was a lot. I mean, I must say, I'm not going to lie. I've been having a blast doing this shooting at different stores. Um, of course, I love the 99 cent store, but it's just really fun to be loading up new and different content onto our channel and to see that all of you are so receptive to it. And um, I can't wait until Christmas starts rolling out. I also am very happy that my Dollar Tree haul is coming along. Um, I think I'm just missing a couple of items that I would like to, some wish list items. But for the most part, I think I've hauled a lot of the fall stuff. Um, I am going to do some other, I'm working on some new content right now for our channel. And as always, my friends, thank you so much for all of your kind and supportive comments. I truly appreciate every single one of you. Welcome all new friends. As always, go out there and have yourselves a great day or a great evening. I will be seeing you soon, my friends. And I hope you enjoyed this Dollar Tree and Hobby Lobby um, haul. Please do me a big favor and hit that like button. It does its free advertisement for our channel, my friends. Thank you.